Good morning. Thanks for coming back again. Today it is the day, November 4th, day after election. And uh, it's a, going to be a beautiful day in the 70s, unseasonably warm. And um, the nation is undecided now who our next president will be. So either way, I think to say some of you will be elated and some of you will be deflated. Um, but as long as you know at the end of the day that you did the right thing, you followed your heart and your mind, whoever you voted for, wherever the country, um, whoever decides, we will go forward with that. And uh, some days you do all that you can do, and as long as you know you did the right thing, that is enough. And that will have to be enough until the morning. So let's read from Psalm 107. Oh, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so, those he redeemed from trouble and gathered in the lands, from the east and from the west, from the north and from the south. Some wandered in desert wastes, finding no way to, inha to an inhabited town. Hungry and thirsty, their souls fainted within them. Then they cried to the Lord in their trouble, and he delivered them from their distress. He led them by a straight way until they reached in an inhabited town. Let them thank the Lord for his steadfast love. For his wonderful works to humankind, for he satisfies the thirsty and the hungry he fills with good things. There is hope in every day because of Christ and because God is in our midst. So matter how you're feeling today, it is still a hope-filled day because it is God's. A gift to you. Let's think about the good things. Let's work on doing better things. And let's pray. Take good care. We're not together physically, but we are spiritually. And that's enough. Take good care. Bye now.